What's up guys, Miller's Cards here, and today I'll be doing a video on a PSA reveal. This was for the January special, I think it was $14.99 or maybe $15.99 a card at PSA. Had an incredible turnaround time, it was like two weeks or something like that, maybe even less. But uh, 22 out of the 26 gemmed, so I'm happy as can be. This is by far my best percentage, it's about an 85% gem rate. And there are some older cards in here too, so to have that happen was incredible. But uh, I scanned these cards really well to make sure that they were in really good shape. So I was hoping for a ton of gems, but I was not expecting to get 22. But we'll start with the non-10s. There was four of them. Here's number one, this Kobe Upper Deck Holographics got a six. I think there is some edge lifting here that I noticed. So that's not going to gem out with that. So I missed on that one. This one I expected to be an eight or a nine. It got the eight, Kobe Focus Pocus. Nine on this Kobe Live Action. And the last non-gem was this Puka Nakua Pink Optic Preview 9. A little bit off-center on the back, and I think there was one surface dimple somewhere in there. But uh, the rest of these are going to be 10, so we'll start with the Kobe and Jordan 10s. NBA Hoops. Couple different hoops inserts. Not super high value cards, but still nice to gem out. This is a nice one. Not a huge pop count on this one. And then this one from 2005 got the gem. Not an easy gem with this foil surface. A lot of times they'll have problems, but this one looked good. Both these Jordans I had pre-graded as 10s. Thankfully they got them. Nice flight team. This is a really beautiful card. I get it's using this wizard's uniform, but the all-white background makes them easier to, to grade too, as long as you have a proper grader, which looks like I did in this order. All-star break coming up, Halliburton starting in it. So good timing on these. This I actually had created a nine. It bumped up to a 10. You can see the top centering is a little lighter than the bottom. It's a little bottom heavy, but it's still got a gem. This Curry was perfect. Believe it or not, nowadays this isn't that crazy of a card. It's probably only a $30 to $40 card, where before it used to be like $60 something dollars. But if you don't gem these out, you're not going to make your money back, even with the special price at PSA. This 2020 Prism class is for football and basketball. It's hard to grade. Most of these cards come off centered when they have a lot of surface issues. Jaw Center stage, pretty low pop on this. I don't think there's ever been a sale. I'd say probably a $50 to $60 card, though. Another one of those cards you want to make sure it's going to gem out or you're going to lose your money. I think this is only $30, $40 card as a 10. This Judge Redux, same thing. It's not a card you're going to make your money back as a 9, so you got to really... Make sure there's absolutely nothing wrong with the card. This one, I thought the bottom centering was a little lighter on than the top. It clearly is just a hair, but with this grader, he was pushing most things through. So this is a really nice card. I think I already sold this for 120 bucks. Pro debut. I kept trying to sell this on Twitter for like $20, which is a little higher than normal Raws go on eBay, but it was in such good shape. And nobody ended up buying it, so I finally decided to send it off, and it's worth a little more than 20 now. This is a nice one. I already sold this one, too, for like 60 bucks. Comps were weird. Some were in the mid to upper 70s, and other were as low as 30s. So now that it's the Cowboys offseason, I'm fine selling that for $60. This one I might hold on until next year with the hype comes back. This is a really nice pull, one of the nicer ones in the order. Marshawn Lynch, this is out of 100 from 2019 Legacy. Same thing, this is a $10 card as a nine. So I'm hoping to get like 34 on eBay. Had a few offers of like 20 to 25, but. Really good timing on these. Super Bowl is in a week. So probably have them on eBay right now. I'm not gonna be really taking offers on them. If they sell full price, I'll take it. But I think the Chiefs have a good chance to win the, uh, the Super Bowl. I expect everything Mahomes related to spike at least a little bit. These already have, in, in fact, in the time that I had sent this order in, these were only like 
$30 cards as gems, maybe $35, $40. But uh, now they're going for as much as $50. A lot of listings are for $60. I have mine at $50. It's the cheapest on the market. But uh, So my home stuff has already jumped with them making the Super Bowl. But that's all I got in this order. That was 26 total cards. Like I said, 22 of them gemmed. Only four did not get the gem, and two of them were nines. One of my best orders ever. My first ever PSA reveal, I think I was, or order I ever did, I didn't even record it. It was like a 75% gem rate, and that was back all the way in 2020. So to get this now with how graders are cracking down and, and they're really pop controlling a lot of stuff, I'm happy with it. But uh, thanks uh, for everybody who tuned in and stayed for the rest of this video, but I uh, appreciate you guys and see y'all later.